thing in the next week. You know what? People probably not complaining. New Year's Eve, you like to get dressed up. Nice to not have to bring your coat along necessarily. <laughs> right. It, it is going to be chilly tonight, but relatively speaking, it could be a lot colder. In the last 24 hours, we picked up some rainfall and some healthy rain at that, close to an inch. In Indianapolis, about a little bit more than a half an inch across parts of Bloomington, uh, almost four tenths of an inch in Evansville and about 0.13 inches in South Bend, more than an inch across parts of Fort Wayne. And we have some of that rain across much of the state right now. Not going to rain all day today, but it will continue for the next few hours. And I think by late morning, we'll begin to see things wind down. So the heavier pockets of rain now exiting the state and moving into western sections of Ohio. But we do have some of that light rain moving in across parts of Indianapolis, also into Johnson County, back to the west, Hendricks County, into Brownsburg, Danville, Plainfield, Avon as well, Zionsville, Lebanon, some light rain for you into parts of Cicero, Noblesville, and Fisher as well and then farther northward uh, seeing some of those steadier pockets of rain near Peru a little more intense shower for you uh, Wabash over to Fairmont and then farther southward still seeing some of that light rain moving into Lawrence County around Bedford Washington and a parts of Bloomington as well mostly cloudy skies and we're seeing a little bit reduced visibility at times so you may see a little bit of patchy fog as well lots of clouds feels like temperature coming in at 35 degrees with an air temperature of 41 north Westerly winds at nine miles per hour. We're at 37 in Lebanon right now, 44 in Greenwood, and it's 46 degrees in Newcastle. So I think by about 9, 10 o'clock, much of the rain will be off to the east of us. We'll stay with the mostly cloudy sky through much of the day, and then later in the afternoon, we may see a few peaks of sunshine. Temperatures today are going to be staying in the 40s. However, normal high for this time of year, about 37, so still running about 10 degrees or so. Above normal, upper 40s in Indianapolis, lower 40s in South Bend, near 50 in Richmond, and lower 50s across the southern sections of Indiana. This evening, if you are going to be out and about celebrating, we'll see those temperatures in the upper 30s, right around that 40 degree mark. And I do think the cloud cover will roll back in here. Overnight, we'll fall to about 39 in Indianapolis, near freezing in South Bend, and close to 40 degrees farther southward. Pretty quiet conditions as we start off your new year on Sunday. I think we'll see lots of cloud cover, but it will be dry Sunday and much of Monday as well. And temperatures are going to begin to start to warm up. I think we'll hit about 50 at noon and into the lower 50s for uh, your Monday or Sunday. And then into Monday, I think we have the potential to see temperatures climb even more. But late Monday night into Tuesday, we're going to be tracking another system. So some more rain will arrive here heading into the overnight hours Tuesday, stretching into the first part of your Tuesday and also into the afternoon as well. And look at these high temperatures, upper 50s, near 60 degrees. Heading into your Monday, mid-60s will be possible farther southward across parts of Evansville and Louisville in your Peterman Brothers 8 day forecast. How about 64 on Tuesday? Record high temperature in Indianapolis on that day, 65 degrees. So awfully close. We'll have to continue to watch that. And then we'll eventually see those temperatures return back to normal uh, for the end of next week.